Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Starlord, and today I wanted to kind of have a little bit of a discussion video. I don't really do many of these, but I will start to if you guys enjoy them. Obviously, we all play Pokemon Brick Bronze here, and, uh, you know, we, we all like discussing what could be in the next update, you know? And uh, me especially, I love discussing things like that. I love speculating what we could possibly see in the 7th gym update. So today, I thought that I would kick it off and discuss, like, five Pokemon that I would love to see, or that will most likely be, in the next update. Uh, please feel free to, to disagree, agree in the comment section below, you know, you have an opinion, and that is fine. But these are just my opinion of the top Pokemon that we will see, or we could possibly, uh, hopefully see, in the next GM update. Let us kick it off with the first Pokemon, which is Articuno. Now, Articuno is a legendary bird. It was introduced into Generation 1, and uh, without a doubt, it's probably uh, everybody's, probably everybody's favorite legendary bird. Mostly everybody's, anyway. When I ask people, like, what's your legend, what, what's your favorite legendary bird, it's either, like, Zapdos or Articuno. Mostly Articuno. Uh, personally, for me, it's Zapdos. I love him. And I always used to get Zapdos um, cards when I was younger. Like, that was the only legendary bird Pokemon I would get on card. Zapdos. Um, but Articuno, with the next gym update, most likely, probably, definitely being uh, an Ice-type gym, uh, we will most likely see Articuno, I think. I think that they will introduce the three legendary birds. Zapdos, Articuno, and Moltres. As you know, they've just introduced the legendary beasts, and uh, they tend to like adding like three legendaries. You know, they added Tundurus, uh, Tornadus, and Landorus. That's three of the, um, what you call it? The uh, mischievous kind of cloud Mons, I forget what they call them. Uh, then they added uh, Entai, Soy Sauce, and uh, Raikou. <laughs> uh, so I'm thinking hopefully they will add Zapdos, Articuno, and Moltres. I would love to get my hands on an Articuno. I would definitely love to get my hands on an Articuno. And uh, if there's anything that my team, my PvP team, is missing right now, that's an electric type. Uh, so Zapdos would be very handy for me, uh, definitely. Now moving on to the next Pokemon, probably one of the best looking awesome Pokemon that will most likely be a new update, that is Galai. I don't know if I've said that correctly, but uh, it's on screen right now anyway. And uh, he's kind of awesome, you know, he looks pretty cool. Uh, and he was introduced into, I, I forget which Pokemon game he was introduced in, but he was very awesome. I remember one of the Elite Four using him as their Pokemon, and he was just a boss. He was so hard to beat. Specifically, probably because I didn't have any fire types or anything like that at the time. Uh, but this Pokemon's awesome. And of course, with most of the uh, updates that they like to update Pokemon Brick Bronze with, they add in a new Mega Evolution. Let's think about the sixth update. Uh, that was the, let's see, you can Mega Evolve uh, Metagross, right? So they added in a new Mega Evolution. Now, uh, Galai actually has a Mega Evolution too. They recently uh, made him a Mega and it looks amazing, like it'll be on screen right now, that's what his Mega Evolution looks like, and it's just totally awesome, totally awesome, I would love to see this guy in the game, I can imagine a lot of people using him in PvP too. Moving on to the next Pokemon, we have yet another kind of legendary kind of Pokemon, I guess, I, I don't really know, uh, but it is Reggie Ice, one of the Titans that you get in the games. Now, it has been, like, it's it's obvious that the Reggies are going to be in the game, because if you look at uh, some people's, like, speculation videos, such as King's, King's has a video showing off where every location for the Reggies could be. Uh, I'm actually going to do one of those videos soon, I've had it planned for a while, just unfortunately with the update coming out, I didn't really find time, um, but Reggie Ice will most likely... Hopefully be in the update. I'm always hoping that all of these Pokemon are, uh, to be honest. My speculation is that if they introduce Articuno and Moltres and Zapdos, they definitely will not introduce Regiice. They cannot possibly introduce Regiice, Registeel, and Regirock. That's just impossible. They won't do it. Uh, because then there'll be like a little bit too many legendaries that have been introduced in that update. And what I'm thinking is that it's either going to be a choice between Articuno, Moltres, and Zapdos that is going to be in the next update, or it could be Regiice, Registeel, and Regirock, and maybe Regigas too. I'm kind of side with the Articuno thing, as I think that they've got a lot of things planned 
for the Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel, and blah blah blah. Um, so yeah, definitely Reggie Ice would be on my top Pokemon to see in the next update. Now moving on to a normal type Pokemon. Uh, this Pokemon's been in the game since it kicked off, and it's probably one of my favorite water type Pokemons that I've ever had the pleasure of catching in any of the games. That is Lapras. Now, unfortunately, Lapras never really got a Mega Evolution, or any other kind of evolution for that matter. I think that Lapras definitely des deserves like a baby form, or maybe a Mega Evolution. Uh, they didn't really give it one, unfortunately. I think uh, if the next gym update includes Surf, then we will most likely see Lapras. You know, he will probably be given to us, or we will get it as some kind of event or something like that. And uh, we can actually use... That could be our first Pokemon to surf on, you know? Uh, I I don't know. I'm really hoping that uh, Lapras will be in the update. I would love to even use it in PvP. It would definitely uh, take place of my Mealtic. Mealtic? 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 Uh, one of them. Anyway, I forget what it's called. How to pronounce it. I would definitely use Lapras in my PvP team if it was introduced into the game. Uh, also, I've never really seen the the shiny version of it. I would really like to see that. It'll probably be on screen right now uh, after I edit the video and uh, if it is on screen, wow, that must really be a nice shiny Lapras. I don't know what it looks like, but I'm thinking it's probably nice. Look at it, guys. It's lovely. But anyway, moving on, we have two normal Pokemon again. Uh, we're gonna start off with the first evolution, which is Kubchu. I think that's how you pronounce it. Kubchu? Kubchu? Like, achoo, because it has, like, you know. Um, Kubachu is a cute Pokemon. You know, they tend to, like, adding cute Pokemon into the game, I think. Uh, because I think it draws in a lot of, like, uh, female players to play, too, you know. And, you know, the cute little Pokemon, it kind of looks, it, it's kind of awesome, you know. It's like uh, Manaphy, you know. Everyone loves Manaphy. Because it's cute and it's it's a it's a badass. Yeah, I'm thinking uh, Kubchu will be definitely a Pokemon they will add into the game without a doubt. Then we obviously have the evolve of it, which is just awesome. A uh, bear tick. I've never actually caught this Pokemon or had it in any of the games. If it's in Pokemon Moon or I actually found that I have Pokemon Sun, not Moon, uh, the other day. But if it's in Pokemon Moon uh, Sun, I will definitely catch it, try it out. Uh, check out what moves it's got and stuff like that. That's another awesome Pokemon that they will most likely add into the game. Going on to the next Pokemon, which is a normal one too, is Bergamite. Uh, Bergamite, it's like this little ice kind of thing. I don't really know. Again, not really a Pokemon that I've caught or anything like that. Um, I am thinking that it is a Gen 7, I think. And uh, they really haven't added any Gen 7 Pokemon into the game. So I'm kind of on the fence with this one. Maybe they will because there's not many ice Pokemon as there is. I don't know. I think Bergmite could possibly be introduced into the game. Maybe. Then we have Avalug, the evolved form of Bergmite. It's, you know, it's the same. It's kind of like one of those Pokemon I've never really tried out. I can't even tell if it's good or not. Just to kind of have something on roots. Uh, I think they could possibly add this one in too. Then our last Pokemon that they could possibly add into the Gym 7 update, which I doubt they will. You know, everything's a possibility. Never say never. Unless you're saying never say never. But we have Kurum. I think that's how you say it. Ky Kyurum. 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 And uh, this one's the uh, legendary kind of Pokemon thing. I don't really know what to call it, but it's awesome. It was in one of the Pokemon games. I can't really remember which one it was in. I think it was in Black and White. I didn't really play Black and White that much. I completed it, but I didn't really play any of the after game content. So yeah, not really sure about this Pokemon either, to be honest. Kyrum would be definitely on the list, um, as I know one or two players actually already have this Pokemon. Unfortunately, that's very horrible that they already have a Pokemon that's Nobody else can get. I think that's wrong. Uh, so, and, you know, obviously with uh, Jamie Jamie, or Jamie Jamie, Jamie Jamie, Jamie 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 with him having the, uh, you know, the Mega Metacross for so many months, I think that Lando kind of thought, you know, let, let's, I, I think it's time to let other players have this Pokemon now. Uh, that's why he decided to add it into the sixth gym update. And um, maybe he's thinking the same with this Pokemon, because I know that some other people have this one too. Anything's a possibility guy. But anyway guys, like I said, you can disagree with me, you can agree with me. If I said anything wrong throughout the video, then please feel free to correct me. I am very sorry though. And uh, yeah, these are kind of my uh, choices for what could be in the seventh gym update. Thanks to whoever just subscribed by the way. <laughs> but anyway guys, thank you so much for watching and until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.